here we have a 23 plate box fresh Land Rover Defender HSE. Now this vehicle comes with the 22 inch SVR style alloy wheels, finished in gloss black, all in excellent condition. We also have the white exterior paintwork, we have the LED daytime running headlights, the Defender badging as well in silver just across the bonnet there as you can see. We also have the grid style panels just there as well on the bonnet. Right to the passenger side you find we have the second alloy wheel just there again unmarked. We also have the side steps along the bottom, colour coded door handles, we have the black door mirrors, we have the black trim around the windows with the privacy glass as well. We also have the black roof rails up top along with the pano glass roof as well which is currently open. We have the rear spoiler as well as you can see just there. We also have 360 degree cameras with front and rear parking sensors. We have the wheel cover as well on the back. We also have the Defender again written in the silver badging as well just there. If we open up the boot, take a look inside of here, you find we have plenty of space. As you can see, quite a large amount of space. We also have a 12 volt connectivity as well just down there. We have the Defender again written just there on the back. If we close that back up and then walk around to the driver's side, you'll find that this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. So if we take a look at the interior, coming into the back first, inside of here you find we have the full leather interior, we have the foldable armrest in the centre, the fixed ISO points as well. We also have the windows as well just at the top as you can see there as well. We have the nice utility style trim as well on the doors, looks very cool. Electric windows, we also have the brush metal handles and the Meridian sound system. If we take a look at the front again at the full leather interior, there's a look at them front seats which are electrically adjustable. They're also both heated or cord as well and also the driver's side has the memory function just there. The electric windows, electric mirrors, we also have the blind spot assist as well on the mirrors. We have the premium meridian sound system. We have a multifunctional steering wheel just there, which is also heated and electrically adjustable as you can see just there. If we take a seat inside, you'll find that we have the auto wipers. We also have the auto lights just there on that stalk. Put our foot on the brake, press the start button, then the vehicle will start up for us and you'll find we'll be free from any warning lights on the digital dashboard. So we can adjust the view if we press onto this circle, you can see we get different bits of information. We can change the display so we can go from two dials to one dial just like so. We can also change the information so for example we have the clock on the right hand side. We can also go across and get different bits of information just here as well and just set that up as you can see like so. Again, we can change the display layout. We can also have a full screen for the sat nav or we can have the driver assistance or the media as well, as you can see it just there. We have the adaptive cruise control. We also have the lane keeping assist as well, just there, the speed limiter as well. Heated seat button, if we press that, then the, the steering wheel will heat up. We also have the main infotainment screen just there in the center, which is touch screen. So as you can see, we have the sat nav just here. We also have a range of media. We have the Bluetooth phone connectivity, a range of media such as the DAB radio. We also have the Bluetooth as well just there. We have the Apple CarPlay and the Android Auto, which will come up once you connect your phone. We also have all these other different bits of information. We can get the 4x4 information just there. The weight sensing, this vehicle is a very capable car for the off-road. If we press onto this button just down here, you can see we have the different drive modes. We have the comfort, it also comes up on the dashboard. We have the mud ruts, gravel, sand. We also have rock crawl just there, and also we have eco as well just on the left. If we go back onto here, you see we have the vehicle dimensions, which is a nice feature to have, as you can see just there. If we put the car into reverse, you find we have the 360 degree cameras. We can have the off-road camera as well, just there. Go back onto the on-road, press onto the 3D. You see we can just change the view just like so. 360 degrees all the way around, super helpful and makes it very safe when maneuvering this vehicle. If we put it back into park, we also have the climate control just down here with the ice cold air conditioning. We just turn the dial and it will change the temperature. If you press it in, then you can put the heated seats on or you can go the other way and it will make it cooled just like so. 
leave that just how it is though. Further down you find we have a Type-C USB port, another USB port just there, and a 12 volt connectivity as well. Some storage space just down underneath there. Two good sized cup holders, we also have a nice leather armrest, again with extra storage just inside of there. But that is all I'm going to show you guys today. If you want to find out more then please check out the website or get in contact. Thank you for watching.